3.2.9, we are going to find the derivative for this function, u minus square root of u times u plus square root of u. The trick here is, you don't need to use the product rule, because if you do algebra first, the calculus part is much easier. So the thing is, we can actually just FOIL this out and see what we get, right? So let me draw the arrows first, and the rest is, you know, just multiply things out. And if you do that, in fact, you can use the formula, but I'll show you guys how uh, the multiplication works. Anyways, u times u is equal to u squared, u times square root of u, let me just write this, plus u square root of u. And the second part, we have negative square root of u times u, which is minus u square root of u. And the last part, negative square root of u times positive square root of u. You have minus, it's pretty much these two are the same, so you can just take out the, uh, the square root, you have minus u. And you see the cool thing is that the middle part cancels. This and that cancels. And in fact, this is just the difference of two squares. You could have used the formulas to multiply it out if you would like. But secretly, h of u is u squared minus u. This is how the this is how innocent the function looks like, all right? Nothing crazy, it's just u squared minus u. By looking at this, I can just use the regular power rule to take the derivative. So the derivative of u to the square, u to the second power, I mean, derivative of that is equal to 2u, and the derivative of minus u is just equal to minus 1. And that's it. This is how innocent this question is.